welcome you to the Hello. Hey. <laughs> we are we are here. We are here. We are here. We are almost there. <laughs> I'm tired. Yesterday really knocked it out of me. I didn't get out of bed today till like 12. And my back really hurts. Like my back really hurts from standing yesterday. I have never done my own sewing again. It looks great, but I'm sleeping. Soft life, Soft life. But yeah, we're here at Sonoma. Yeah. In Gatwick waiting for our flight to come. I've barely said two words. I'm so tired. I am ready to sleep. Thank God this is an overnight flight. When we get to the hotel tomorrow, I'm also sleeping. Oh, 100%. Yeah, there's, 100%. No, there's no choice about it. But it looks like super cute. It is very cute. Super cute. Definitely Funky. Like, Mexican. Yeah, yes. very funky. Our food came and everything looks really good. Apart from the fact that we have five weeks each. <laughs> that is a serious That's why it came so quickly. <laughs> You ain't gotta kill many chickens to give someone five wings, I tell ya. <laughs> but yeah, I got a chance. He needs some milk! <laughs> Not in this day and age, you can't do that in this era. I got a chai latte with oat milk. I got some Mexican breakfast. And uh, even though it's like eight in the evening, and I got some chicken wings, five chicken wings to be precise. Um, <laughs> <laughs> and then got a cappuccino and some wings as well. <laughs> so yeah, I'm gonna douse this with some sweetener. And I already have snacks in my bag. Ladies and gentlemen, this is your captain speaking, and I would like to welcome you aboard this flight from London Gatwick to Dubai. Please prepare for takeoff and arrival into sun and breeze where soft lights and glowing skins are guaranteed, and much food and laughter is on the horizon. Your enjoyment is our number one priority. to Dubai. We've made it. It's great here. It's very pretty. Renee's over there. Say hi Renee. Give the people a wave. They've come to see you. Wow, she's really dead dick material. Girl. <laughs> she can't hear me. But yeah, we've got here. I look a hot mess. But essentially, we got to the hotel at 8.30 in the morning. Our check-in time. <laughs> Our check-in time is that too. And we're both too tired to really do anything, so we're just sitting here. And whilst sitting here, it's come to my realization that I left my toothbrush at home. So, they give you that at hotels. It's a beautiful place, though. It's very nice. They're barely in the hotel. Oh my. Material girl. So, I just spent like an hour and a half on TikTok. And I'm about to continue. My eyebrows look so thin. I rushed my eyebrows yesterday, this morning, at some point in the last 24 hours. And I don't like how they turned out, but they'll grow. Like God's grace. We finally made it to our room, guys. Can I come in now? Renee says she wants to do something for you guys. So welcome to our hotel room. <laughs> my days. <laughs> <laughs> Is this you acting natural? I didn't even 
realize you were wearing your sunglasses. I thought you were just lying. <laughs> Ow. Anyway. Have you seen that meme? Yes. Of, um, what's her name? Whoa, I look so distressed. Who? On the bed like this. Yeah. Hotel room tour, please excuse the way that I look. I looked okay before. It's been several hours since I lost gazed at you, uh, my friends on the internet. So, apartment tour, I mean, hotel tour, an ironing board. Oh, there's an iron. Oh, wow. Wow, y'all. Y'all didn't want to save that. <laughs> Wardrobe, extra pillow, security, I mean, safe. Does this open or is it just a mirror? Just a mirror, but it's a very nice and long mirror. Full body pictures soon come. Ew. And then obviously that is Renee. Two single beds, <laughs> which are very Renee. close to each other. Yeah, they're very, they're Might as well be a double bed. That's why they do double beds though. I would like a cool facing room though. Is it too much if we start asking to be moved? Um, a chair very close to where I want to lay my head. <laughs> <laughs> Painting another reflective area. It's a quite a dark mirror, but it would work as a mirror. This is the view. I haven't even shown them the bathroom yet. This is the view from the window. You know, it's not the best. It's not terrible though. Um, the angles of this room are very weird. Um, but I mean, it's quite cute. Like the blue theme, the bl blue theme is cute. There's a little desk, there's a mirror, there's a TV. That's the fridge. Um, there's like a little ottoman, which is tiny, a tiny coffee table. Everything just feels very squashed though. This is the bathroom, right? So you close the door first. See, look how close the door swings to the sink. That's the red flag number one. That this this is a small bathroom. Only one person can use this bathroom. So you go to the, exactly you go to the bathroom. Okay, sink, boom, bam, bam, toilet, bam, bidet, bam, bath. You are done. Literally, guys, you could just, I could just do a three sixty here. Three sixty. It's quite small. It's quite petite. It's quite a petite bathroom. They have toothpaste. Mirror that comes out or when flips, okay. Hello, hi. So since we've been here, I must come, oh, I'm talking to the vlog, sorry. <laughs> so since we've been here, I have slept. I have napped, as soon as we got in, I slept, okay. I was tired. But we're going to go and find something to eat and we have decided we are going to go to cake, cake, cake cheesecake factory. Cake time. Cake time. <laughs> Go to Cape Town, aka Cheesecake Factory. Um, this is what I'm wearing. So I'm wearing this dress from Primark. Um, it is this brown ribbed dress, and I have this bag from Shein. I'm wearing these sandals from this is my suitcase. You're gonna ignore that. I'm going wearing these sandals. I think they're from ASOS, but they're from ages ago. They are like wrap around flat sandals, and my jewelry is ASOS. Obviously, my glasses are from Flip Savers. These chubby hoops are also from ASOS, and my watch is from Vitae. Um, yeah, super cute, casual outfit. It's just Cheesecake Factory, but I'm actually very excited to try it because Big Bang Theory. And then this is Renee's outfit. Hey, girl. Okay, give it to him. Yeah. <laughs> Do you want to tell the girls where your items are from? Um, this is just the plain top from Forever 29. Okay. Um, this skirt is from Primark. We love to see it. The sandals are from ASOS. Okay. And the bag. It's vintage. It's, vintage. it's from mommy. From my mama. <laughs> statement, it's, it's vintage. It's very cute. A very cute outfit. But yes, we're about to head out to get an Uber there. Um, I'm really liking this dress actually. Who would have thought I would have fit into outfits from Primark? But I find that when something is ribbed and it's stretchy, you can fit into any size. Baby, you don't know what you do to me. Between me and you, I feel a chemistry. I won't let no one come and take your place. Cause the love you give, you can't be replaced. So go on now.
we made it into the Dubai Mall, guys, and it is stunning, absolutely beautiful. Look how big this drink is. This is even heavy. This is like a liter of drink. This is strawberry lemonade. They bought some bread and we're struggling to know what to order. There's a lot of stuff. I hope this is nice. Can I get a blinking? Oh yeah, 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 sure. So I'm not a fan of the table right now, guys. The aftermath of it all, I've not made it. We tired, man. This is a lot of food. Look who we bumped into, to Dubai. <laughs> I mean, Rene, Rene did not find me. No, Look who found she me at the Dubai Oh, hey, she. You remember she, that was on her podcast. My sis from another part of the world. She lives in Dubai now, fancy girl. <laughs> So that's our first day in Dubai done. I couldn't finish like half of my food at the Cheesecake Factory. So I got it to go. Um, and we just finished taking some pictures for the gram for our first day. It was so good popping into Sheen. Um, we're actually meeting up on Sunday to go to the Museum of the Future, which I really want to go to. And now we're getting a Kareem home because she said that it's actually cheaper than Uber. So hopefully we can save more money to spend on nice stuff like food. If you actually ask me what I have done since coming to Dubai, all I can tell you is eat and sleep. Sleep and eat. I just woke up from a nap. I'm tired. All I want to do is sleep. My muscles really hurt and I thought it was because of on Sunday, obviously standing, doing the sew-ins, hands up high behind my head, all of those kind of acrobatics. But I'm still sore and I'm still tired. And this morning I banged my toe into a wall. Is this self-destruction? Is this what it looks like? We'll figure it out. We're about to go to the beach. Renee went to the gym whilst I was having my nap. So we're about to go to the beach. It's not that I don't want you here. It's something about the way you stare into my eyes. I know that I don't make things clear. I fall for you every time I try to resist. Thinking get away. I'm just bitch fuels in an every day. Oh, this sun is fantastic. It's hot. Fantastical. At this beach is beautiful. Oh my day. Blue. Oh, how lovely. This beach is so nice. Very pretty. Very cute. I am ready to get in the water there. Come to it. 
Dubai has pigeons too. Wow, not London Haiki being an island. We too have this tropical creature. Look at me, all tanned up. Hey, Miss Renee! Oh my god! You <laughs> me again. Give us a swimming tutorial, girl! Step one, act like you're swimming. Step two, look like you're swimming. Step three, you are swimming. <laughs> Even the last of the water bed the fact that I'm even this far, 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 I'm also, I'm getting salt water all over my leave out. <laughs> all I can pray is that next week when I go to wash my hair, it's still there. <laughs> wow, okay. Ow, 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 ow. Definitely highly recommend. We watched the sunset. Um, it was really warm at the beginning. It was really hot at the beginning, but then it cooled down as the sun was setting. And now we're going to go and grab dinner at Salt, which is right next to the beach, as you can see. Did you enjoy the beach today, Renee? I did. It was I had a such great a good time. time yeah. Right? I love the beach now. Fun fact, guys. I love water, but I'm afraid of drowning. Mm. So, you know, I wasn't trying to, I was just trying to dip my toes in the water, you know what I'm saying? But Courtney was obviously, you know, down there. And I was like, yeah, grandma, come. And she was like, come, you can overcome your fear of drowning. Aww. And yeah, I was there like, my oh, weave got wet, everything. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> I Not the testimony there. being, I, I dip my there. hair in the water. There. I dip my hair in the water. That was good, man. I, I can't recommend enough. The yeah. beach, the humidity, like, yeah. Everything was beautiful. It was great, man. And now we are at Salt getting dinner. So, like Renee said, today was very nice. It was yes. very cute. Yes. Um, I actually can't wait to try this truffle burger. Yes. I feel very like dusty. Like I feel like that salt water has really done a number on my skin. So once we get home, it's moisturizing all up. Babe. But we did well. We were on top of our sunscreen. We did. Everything was good. Everything was good. Also, these glasses from Primark. Gorgeous. A star. A star. I know. Renee wore them for a bit. The like filter on these or the lenses on these are so nice. Like everything is so warm. So yeah, that's my little fashion tip of the day. Honestly, Primark sunshades in general were just slapping. And it was like three pounds. Mad. Crazy. But I still want these Chanel sunglasses. Oh. Yeah. But look at the view, y'all. Look at the view. Thank you, Renee. Look at that. So um, they've actually started prayer. So the um, the beach was emptied, and we decided to come and get dinner. But yeah. I am loving Dubai so far, it's guys. So it's so, so this is so lovely. Everything about it. Also, I can't wait to try that ice cream. That lotus sundae. For me, that cinnamon, baby. Oh, baby. We 
forever since I've actually well it feels like forever since I picked up the camera obviously I showed you last night but this morning all we did was get breakfast and I had a nap I've realized PMS my PMDD like I get so fatigued and tired um, before my period is coming and I don't know why every vlog it's like I talk about my period but it's a big deal for me guys um, if you don't know about my PCOS journey just go and watch that video but in essence <laughs> I have been feeling really tired my, mus my muscles have been very sore this always happens before my period comes but anyway I took a nap after breakfast and um, breakfast was actually really good the breakfast here is quite good I'd say and um, quite basic but anyway we're going to the desert today we're going on a desert safari and I have been struggling to figure out what to wear because obviously I have all these clothes um, some of them are like tight fit ribbed um you know shirts jeans stuff like that but i just want to be super comfortable today so i've put on this set from misguided so this is a police co-ord um and it's lime green the only thing about this, this set is perfect the fit i love it the color is lovely the only thing is i don't know if this color will look good in the desert because obviously like the desert it's sand it's warm tone it's arabian uh warmth do you get what i mean this is a very cool tone situation it's coming off kind of yellow but it's like a yellow green so it's like lime like a lime slime so i'm gonna wear it anyway because it's the most comfortable thing i have it's nice and like loose fitting and obviously it's breezy like i can i won't get too hot and that's the one thing i don't want as much as i want to look cute and get a cute picture i don't want to be like sweating um too much my hair is still in pink colors i literally just got out of the shower and got ready so i'm gonna find some shoes to wear um i'm probably just gonna wear like my brown birkenstocks or i don't really have like white shoes finding shoes now is another issue we'll figure it out we'll figure it out yeah so that's what we're wearing and i'm wearing these sunglasses with it which are also from primark um which are super cute um so yeah that's what i'm wearing with these and i'm probably gonna wear a white bag um but obviously we're going to the desert so i don't know where i'll be able to put my bag if i do wear a white bag so we shall see also one thing that i forgot to show you was that yesterday my leave out got wet so obviously i was in the sea doing up you know swimming queen <laughs> And my leave out got wet well my ponytail got wet and my leave out obviously some of it was in my ponytail so i had to come back and wash my leave out so i shampooed all the like salt water out especially because i didn't want my hair to get dry um so i like shampooed it with the hotel shampoo which i'm sure isn't the best but it didn't like make my hair feel super dry or anything and then i conditioned it um and then i straightened it so i have my straightener here and they have a blow dryer here which is actually really good the blow dryer in the bathroom so i just blow dried my hair including my weave as well the weave is a little bit dried out but you know if it gives me troubles it's going in a ponytail i don't have time so next time i go on holiday to somewhere hot guys it's braids it's braids all the way i'm happy that i'm not wearing a wig because it's hot here um and wigs are hot like it's hot under there but also 
having this weave and I know like having my hair out would have been a lot for me because I actually don't like styling my hair on a daily basis so this has been too much too much work and that's why I like wigs because wigs you style it you take it off you wear it the next day the style is still preserved as long as you haven't done anything too tough but with braids it's the same like you you're always styled and you just have to do your edges if you want to do that so next time i'm doing straight back braids for sure and i feel like that would be easier but look at me already thinking about my next holiday as if i don't have work to do and um, to my sisters has a very exciting announcement happening on the 28th of march and i can't wait to actually announce it like i've been budding with so much excitement so much joy so much gratitude that we finalized that yesterday um because we're still working even though we're oh, 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 we're out of office and yeah we're still finalizing work stuff but it's okay because this is exciting work stuff so let me finish getting ready i'm not going to wear any makeup today or anything but yeah let me finish getting ready and then we're going to go to the desert safari baby <laughs> scary moments of my life wow camels it's a no from me it's a no from me dog oh guys this has been a great part of the trip i'm not gonna lie the camel tried to kill me because i'm overweight but it's okay, it's okay. crying inside
thank you very much. Would you like this one? Do you want this one? Yes, please. This one? The, I want this one. Yeah. Thank you very much. I have some Oh, that's very pretty. That's a cute one. You can write names. Oh, wow. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, that's so much. That's so. You're very talented. Me too, I'll say, yeah, if someone told me I was so good, I'd say, yeah. Wow, not us spending money like we got it like that. <laughs> Do the pose. We are about to have dinner and watch a show. Did you say they breathe fire here when they fight yeah, fire? So that should be fun and then we're getting soft drinks. This tastes like crack. This is so good. No, I don't know what that tastes like. Okay, you okay. So all my Ghanaian people, please tell me this VIP area, does it not look like they're going to host the funeral? Because it's given a one week, one week morning. So we just got back from our day out. How was it, Renee? It was transformational. Wow, um, not. My soul was changed. It was an experience. Yeah. It was indeed. They call it an experience. Yeah. We experienced things. Many things. Um, I'll give it a strong 7 out of 10. Okay. The three that was locked off, the food... Terrible. Oh my god, that food was awful. Guys, have you ever had sorry, I have to turn it to me for a second. Have you ever had meat that tasted like it had, <laughs> when it was alive? It had been alive for 124 years. <laughs> no, that, and so that kebab <laughs> was the matriarch of its lineage. I'm telling you now. I'm telling you. She's been around. She's been around. You know what? She around. <laughs> I put it in, as soon as I put that thing in my mouth, I said, uh, uh, I'm not eating somebody's grandmother. She was, she was loose. <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> but yeah, sorry, let me con let, continue around. with your review. So, yeah, the food definitely took off a good two, two and a half. For yeah, me. that was terrible, o honestly. Actually, awful. <laughs> <laughs> the other point five, I would probably say 
the uh, what do you call it the dune thingy okay you didn't like that you know what i, I loved like, it i like roller coasters but i yeah. like that roller coasters i know what i'm here for uh, this dune buggy and i didn't know what to expect so i was just like why is this man driving as though he hasn't actually passed his driver's license like yeah. his test or anything so it just felt like a very uncomfortable and bumpy ride to me i was just like this is doing too much the sound looked beautiful outside yeah it was lovely aside from that i was like this is doing entirely too much also we've got pictures oh my gosh you should show them our pictures oh yeah where'd i put mine this is me on where'd i put mine oh mine is by the door i'm gonna look call at her doesn't she look i'm so gonna call her cute. Teresa. what the camel was definitely a boy you think so? I think so. The energy it was giving definitely was masculine. Is, is my... <laughs> it was definitely Not masculine, masculine energy. <laughs> That's me it was given I'm a high value camel. No. No, should we call him Kevin? Should we call him Kevin? Let me show you my And this is me on a... Woo, I just dropped it. That is so funny. And this is me on a quad bike in my slime wait, green. Wait, 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 this was actually wait. really fun. This was my favorite part. Well, yeah, this was my favorite part. And then we saw like a belly dance. I've shown you guys all of this already, but the night was really, really good. Mm -hmm. Highly recommend. I will put the details of where we, the service that we took, because it was really affordable. I think it was like, how much was it? Like 45 40, pounds, 40 pounds? 43? Yeah, 43 pounds for us doing everything that we did. Obviously, there were some extras like this. We had to pay for the pictures and the souvenir that we got. But I will link it down below so that you guys don't get bumped or lost. Um, but I'm about to finish that cheese, this Cheesecake Factory burrito because that food we had there, whoo wee abysmal. I'm currently looking at really <laughs> Terrible, <laughs> terrible. <laughs>
line here is terrible. Not me out here looking like a banshee. No, not you, not you. Just like, in general, it's dark. Hey guys, we're having a Miss Lily. Settling in. The menu actually looks really good. We are currently waiting. Falling in love, not falling out. Caleb and Borders, but they're not here. Each of us both down in the crowd. I'm actually very hungry. That's what we it had me so relaxed and yes, we love you. So we love you. Both called it from the beginning. Especially if you're the one who's saying. You knew that the right to be nice. Hi everyone so yesterday's food this is my leftovers i'm going to have it for lunch today because it was entirely too much like that was enough lamb to feed a small family and why is this so hot so yeah i'm gonna have it because we didn't go to breakfast today i also ordered some plantains and this is a huge portion of plantain you ordered like plantains on the side in london and they'll give you three slices for four pounds and this is how this is the amount and i ate some yesterday yeah, yeah. matting but yeah i'm gonna have this for brunch i'll show you my face but i look knackered <laughs> tired um <laughs> literally went to sleep at like 3 a.m because i was researching how to become a travel influencer <laughs> <laughs> start my new path in life i like it and that's okay you know it is that's I'm right, I'm supporting you. Thank you. I'm supporting you in this pivot. Big love, big love. Do it. Thank you. Will and you guys ride with me? With me? <laughs> <laughs> Do you have a plus one? Yes. <laughs> she already here. She's actually behind me. <laughs> so Sometimes you just need a good old lazy day. We have not beefed. This must be the maddest angle. Anyway, I realised I, <laughs> ah, I haven't talked much on this vlog because I haven't had much to say. I don't know. I don't know what else to say. <laughs> She's too busy looking pretty. Thank you, girl. We've, we've been too busy looking pretty, but also just doing stuff. And this has really just been a relaxing holiday, like time to rest. And so that's what we've been doing. But today we're going to Dubai more and hopefully we can buy some oud that's actually like my number one thing on the list right now um to get some perfume we're going to cheesecake factory Yay! and we're going to this rest is hookah a restaurant a bar a cafe it's a, okay we're going to this restaurant bar cafe called hookah <laughs> um and they have this notorious selfie coffee selfie coffee um where they like put your picture on the foam of your coffee so that should be cool you know all the vanity um that should be cool and tomorrow's our last day which is super sad but we're spending the day with sheen we're going to go for brunch like a late brunch and the museum of the future which i actually showed you in a clip when we were on the way to the sheraton last night to go to miss lily's because we passed it in the uber um what's that noise Oh, maybe like a hoover but yeah we passed it in the uber and it looks really really fun there's actually so much happening in dubai at the moment there's the creator the creator summit by nas um i might have said that all the way wrong but there's just basically loads of creators in dubai at the moment for this um thing there's obviously the dubai expo expo 2020 and i believe that's tonight which davido is performing at well we went to go to that why are you hiding yourself? <laughs> <laughs> so we were meant to go and see Davido this evening. <laughs> I don't know if we're going to make it, to be fair. The way we have romanticised this idea of getting Cheesecake Factory, we already know what we're going to get. Cinnamon! Listen, <laughs> okay, here's, my, here's, my, here's my, like, gripe here. Yeah. So basically, the last time we went to the Cheesecake Factory... Yeah they said that they didn't have the cheesecake that i wanted yeah i if you want to know something about me is i love cinnamon and everything she does. i love like cinnamon buns i love cinnamon like drinks yeah. I just cinnamon everything everything crazy loco um, so <laughs> had, like, 
a Cinnabon <laughs> cheesecake. Mm -hmm. Cinnabon dream. You know the way that they dress these things up on the menu? A Cinnabon dream cheesecake. I was thinking, this sounds like me. And the babe at the cheesecake factory said that they didn't have it. Yeah. So I didn't get another cheesecake. I went to go and get Ben's cookies, which is ah. Oh, Chef kiss. Chef I really kiss. died from cookies that day. It was fantastic. I'm going to die from them again today. Yeah, we're going to get some because I need to try it. If they don't have the Cinnabon cheesecake when we arrive at the Cheesecake Factory again, I'm going to have a fit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to have a tantrum because I've been waiting to have it. So please be praying for me, guys. Fingers crossed we're going to get that Cinnabon, Cinnabon dream cheesecake. Yes. <laughs> the posture of a person who has resolved <laughs> that they will fight. <laughs> they, 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 they will fight they you some cinnamon, <laughs> some cheesecake. Wow. They're going to find it for me today. 100%. Whether this is a big like mood. They're going to have to import it from the States. <laughs> they don't have it. And Courtney's been out here talking about oh, RNA. Make sure you have a plan B, a backup. Ain't no backup. Here. <laughs> it's cinnamon or nothing. Or then we might go for the chocolate. Yeah, I was about to say, you do have a backup. <laughs> <laughs> either way, we'll get a cheesecake. And it's got to have either cinnamon, pecans, salted caramel. Oh, uh, that like caramel that. pecan. A few moments later. So we've come down to the hotel lobby. I'm taking vlogging so seriously this holiday. I really love it for me. I really love it for me. We've come down to the hotel lobby. Um, and we're waiting for a taxi and here they call it a Korean um, well it's not they call it a Korean they have like a version of Uber called Korean like how we have Bolt and stuff like that so we're waiting for that and it's a bit cheaper than using Uber so if you can get your hotel if you are coming here get your hotel to book you a taxi um, or use the Kareem app now uh, Renee hasn't had the most pleasant experiences with the Kareem app I <laughs> she gives it a zero out of ten I haven't been able to download it because they need to send you a verification code to your phone number um, and obviously I have my UK sim in and I don't want Vodafone to move mad with me so I just put my phone on airplane mode so I can't download it but anywhere you go to like a, a hotel or your hotel concierge like anyone can book one for you and call them and they'll come um so yeah it's much cheaper than uber we have found um unless they're doing like a surcharge thing and apparently their surcharges are very seriously like very serious so just pay attention to how much they're going to charge you to go to where you're going to but it feels like where we are staying it's in reach to most places so we haven't had to take very long taxi journeys i don't think we have the only place that we've like taken a long journey to is when we went to the desert safari and that was a pickup so they sent a private they sent a they send a private car to pick you up um it's the same car you do the dune bashing in so we didn't really have to pay for what was included in our trip so yeah i'm gonna leave all the information of like things that we have done places we've gone outfits i've worn and stuff like that in the description um just in case you want to check out any of that and also just give you some information about dubai as well so we are about to go to the dubai more to do all the things i told you about before oh our car is here perfect that thing quick for real So bright outside. Well, thank you so much. Falling in love, not falling out. I keep on falling. Each of us both down in the crown. A crown, a crown, a crown. A king and a queen royally bound. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Both called it from the beginning. To be nice, do what we gotta do to stay winning. Winning, fussing the fights we'll keep and trust. And you mean you want to say, I love you better today than yesterday. Every day is gonna play out the same. Okay, we just 
made it to the mall <laughs> in one piece. This is a different place to where he dropped us last time. Ooh, okay. It smells good already. Every time we enter in here, it just smells like, you know, heaven or something like that. <laughs> Honestly, Dubai smells lush. Get back to the UK, we're gonna actually take away the toilet. <laughs> <laughs> Dubai smells so good. London actually stinks. We were talking about this yesterday at dinner, actually. London stinks, but New York stinks. But, anyways, oh, New, York. New York is an amazing place. Please don't New come for me in the comments. It just did me smelly a little bit. Oh, oh, okay. So, we've come basically where we ended it last time. Okay, yeah. fine. With a Freddy bag. <laughs> Look at what we have just found. Wow. Iconic, I think they say. Iconic. I think that's what the girls call it. <laughs> and peek what is in here because I'm on the hunt to find this smell. Ooh, this smells lovely. <laughs> okay. okay. I don't think I like cardamom. Minute. Wait a minute. I get 50% off a third one. This place is the hooker. <laughs> Don't look at me. I'm a perfect mother. I shouldn't even be here. Oh, okay. So these are the two that I've decided on. Okay, so I picked up three fragrances and I am very happy with my choices. I will show you probably when I'm back in London to be fair, but they smell absolutely amazing. And we're currently at Hooker waiting to get a table outside. Um, apparently this has amazing views of like the Burj Khalifa and the fountain, so that would be great. Guys. Also the staff, um, the guy who served us at this perfumery was absolutely lovely. He was very, very kind because I smell like a million and ten different fragrances and he was so patient. Wow. Thank you. So this is what we're getting. A selfie latte. And you basically have to WhatsApp them like a picture of yourself. So let's see what that comes out like because you know we black. <laughs> so let's see. But these views impeccable.
still gets under my skin But is it worth all the stress, all this constant he said, she said, mess Pressure of society, huh? Won't let it get to me, not defined by Mine has come. Romantic. I literally changed my profile picture from this yesterday. Um, but here we are, the iconic duo. The duo. I can't even explain it. Nah, nah. Maybe it's the way you look in my eyes. How I feel is beyond words. Can't describe how you ignite this fire so deep inside. Got me hot like the summer. It's happening again. <laughs> Not I'm getting the show twice. <laughs> Got him. Do <laughs> them little things and make my heart melt. I look how you can take a joke just as well as you speak to my soul. All the passion that your voice holds. We went to Cheesecake Factory, but I guess because there are so many people here, it's a 35 minute wait. Last time we came, we were sat down immediately, but that's fine. So this girl is intensely watching me vlog. This girl sitting with her legs for us. It's kind of creepy. <laughs> but she's very cute. <laughs> Not somebody's shout. But yeah, so we just came to, they gave us the waiting thing, the thing that they buzz. Um, so they put us in the queue. It's 35 minute wait for a table for two. So we came next door to this cafe which has um, Parrot, which is chai tea basically. And Sheen actually recommended that we try Parrot Ice. So luckily they have an iced version. So we're just gonna sit here and get it. It's like three pounds. And it's a great place to wait because we're in radius to she's think actually to get the butter topping. So we're just gonna kill some time. And I'm gonna think about what I'm gonna do to celebrate my birthday, which is in about six weeks. So. That smoothie looks so good. That smoothie looks nice. Okay guys, I don't want to get copyrighted so quick thing. They don't have the cinnamon. They don't have the cinnamon the cinnamon cheesecake. Terrible. I am scandalized guys. <laughs> but it gets worse because they don't even have our flipping backup. Yeah, they don't have the backup, they don't have the caramel pecan, the turtles one, they don't have it. So I might stick to the one I got last time and get the red velvet one because that was good. That was actually good, but I sad they don't have the ones yet. It's heartbreaking. <laughs> it's heartbreaking. I almost called the police up in this place. When she said we ain't got no cheesecake, I was like, you the cheesecake factory, go make some. Go and make some. This is our current situation. Hello. 
I look I literally just woke up and I showered and my shower cap is here but basically today is our last day in Dubai oh ignore all the stuff listen we're getting ready to go out but today is our last day in dubai and we're actually going to meet up with sheen go get brunch lunch and possibly go to the museum of the future i'm not too sure but i wanted to get make some headway in editing today's episode because i haven't done it yet i think i explained this is this not on sorry my laptop charger is not on i think i explained this the other day but the video uh the episode that we we're meant to have going out last week this week was not approved by the sponsor and so we basically had to do some last minute filming in order to get the uh like to in order to have episodes while we were away but because we filmed so last minute i wasn't able to edit both i was only able to edit um in the time i would have edited this week's episode today's episode i had to edit the episode for the following day if that makes sense um so i am currently full actually editing the episode that's going out today so let's get to work okay so editing canon nearly finished i got through a lot more than i thought i would but this is today's outfit white shirt oh you can't really see but i'm wearing like some um jeans from simply b they're like ecru color they're like a cream color i'm sure you can see that and then glasses from Primark. jewelry is from asos vite watch um and this bag from asos as well it's definitely giving I have a summer home. I like that. The weather is lovely today. We're running actually a little bit late. got back from dinner um no lunch dinner lunch dinner because we literally stayed there from like two two oh yeah supper maybe um in that whose stuff is that is that your stuff the red stuff that on the island board. oh yeah okay um that's so <laughs> somebody else's stuff in the room oh my god but yeah we just came back from dinner um ibn al Baha, which was fantastic the curry was really nice the octopus was a little bit leave it but the calamari was also really good um fish tasted really good so we are back i'm going to continue my editing and then eat my cheesecake <laughs> i've been looking for we were sitting in that restaurant i was just thinking about that cheesecake the whole time also i wore one of the perfumes that we bought yesterday love it i love it i love it i love it on me but yeah, I'm going to get changed now. Edit, pat, and say goodbye to DXB. DXB, you've been good to us. You have, you were the break we needed. So highly recommend Dubai trip with your girls. Let's do it. <laughs>
<laughs> so we got to the airport um, quite an early flight, like our flight is at 7.40, it's currently 5am and there's quite a few people here, but um, I'm going to be Gentlemen, this is your captain speaking. We are preparing to take off from Dubai and we will arrive in London in a few hours. There are a few winds of responsibility blowing and reports of rising living costs. However, we hope you have rested and enjoyed your trip. Please be encouraged that you can handle all that awaits you. I would like to thank you for flying with us today. Please stay beautiful and stay blessed. Yeah.